Hi Leo, welcome to your daily love reading. My name is Pretty, and I'll be doing your love reading today. So before we begin with your love reading Leo, please do remember to take what resonates and to leave behind whatever does not. Okay, so let's begin with your love reading Leo. Okay, so at the bottom of the deck, we have the Knight of Pentacles, and this is Earth Energy, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn Energy. So this is a card of uh, some sort of forward movement, but very slow movement, very slow progress. Um, someone is coming in here with some, it's like they have the intention of committing, but they are moving slowly towards that. Okay, so let's see. Okay, we have the two of wands, Fire Energy. Queen of Pentacles, Earth Energy, and the Hanged Man, Pisces Energy. So someone is really thinking a lot. They're looking at the situation from multiple perspectives. They're more so planning. They're being very careful with how they approach you. Um, it's because they put you on a, a bit of a pedestal with the Queen of Pentacles. They think highly of you. They see you as someone who deserves the best and someone who they have to put their best foot forward with. So this person is really over... Uh, it's like they, they're being very cautious before coming in. Um, they want to offer you the best. They want to offer you something worthy of a Queen of Pentacles. Okay, so let's clarify these cards. Okay, we have the six of pentacles and this is earth energy so this person really wants to give you something they could be wanting to gift you something or they want some sort of partnership with you but they are under this impression that they need to bring a lot so they need to have something of value to offer you so this person definitely is looking for some sort of opportunity to give to you here okay so let's see okay, we have the justice card libra energy the full Aquarius energy and the Knight of Wands fire energy. Okay, so they, they want some sort of a beginning with you here with this full card. They are ready to embark in some sort of new starts. It could be that they want to wipe this day clean here. If this is someone who you've been in some sort of no contact or separation from, they are wanting a fresh start. And there's an energy of taking accountability for something with the Justice card. Um, there's an energy of really wanting to be fair, wanting a, a fair, balanced, equal partnership. Um, this person may even be coming in with some sort of an apology here, but they're, they're first gaining the confidence to do this. So it may be a bit delayed, whatever this is that they're coming towards you with. Um, but they are waiting to feel confident enough. And I do see there's something about being in a, having to change their perspective, their mindset or their approach before coming in here. Okay, so I'm going to pull out an oracle card for you, Leo. Okay, so we have nothing is yet set in stone, mutable moon. Yeah, this person is, they sh their perspective is shifting. They're doing their homework. They want to do better by you. There's something they want to fix here. Yeah. Okay, so I'm going to put another card for you. Okay, so we have unrequited love. There's not enough attraction or chemistry to keep this relationship going. Okay, so this person could be wanting to start something again. Um, it's almost like in the past they didn't have that drive. There's something that came to a complete standstill. Like, um, you know, you may have been under the impression this person wasn't even um, interested or available. Um, but it's like there's a shift that's happening here. This person feels like they need to make up for something here because they were not giving to the situation in the past. Okay, so I'm going to pull out another card for you.
Okay, we have red rose, hidden secrets. Three things cannot be long hidden, the sun, the moon, and the truth. So this person could have hid their true feelings for you, which could have made you feel like they were not interested. Um, but there's something about you staying in that queen of pentacles energy. It's like you holding yourself in high regard, you not chasing this person, you knowing your worth. It's kind of forcing them to, you know, shift gears, look at the situation differently, forcing them to come to you, really. Okay, so I'm going to pull out a card for your advice, Leo. We have surrender your desire to control people. Being over controlling can sabotage relationships. To more effectively achieve your goals, back off, regroup, and give the situation some breathing room. Okay, so that's what I'm seeing for you, um, Leo. I hope you have a really, really good day, Leo. Bye, Leo.